In today's video, I'm going to show you a rune farm that helps you massively get some quick runes. So please make sure to smash the like button, subscribe and hit that notification bell if you want to see more content like this in the future. And let's get straight into it. So I have been taking my time playing Elden Ring and I finally got to the Zamor ruins. And what I have come across is one of these warriors. They are very, very deadly in their self. They can do a lot of damage and they can kill you with a couple of blows. But, as I've killed the one that struggles this road here, I ended up getting 6,000 ruins just by killing him alone. So, what I did do, I thought I'd give it a go and I came to this grey spot right here. I thought I'd try and gather up all of the enemies in this area and see if there's a spot where I can easily kill them. So, I did take off my golden trinket. That means that I get less ruins, but I wanted to see how many ruins I ended up getting just by doing this without a golden trinket without the boost if I was just a person that was just trying to dash through the game and I didn't end up having a golden trinket if you guys haven't got it I will be making a video if you want to see that let me know down below um, but I ended up finding this passage here so if you go down this area you end up getting the enemies attacking you but they don't end up doing any damage to a certain point so this gives you like a little whack-a-mole point where they keep trying to hit you as long as you stay out of their damage area and keep poking back and forth you should easily be able to kill them if you didn't notice, I started off with 60,000 ruins, but I ended up having around 82,000 ruins afterwards. So I ended up getting around 20k ruins just by killing these alone. And it's a very, very simple and easy method to actually do. It takes you around a minute and a half to actually do this, depending on whereabouts you are getting attacked from. If you guys are clumsy and you get boxed in, you can easily just jump out, let them follow you, and then run back down the tunnel. But they can still kill you because they can overwhelm you fairly easily. So just find the perfect spot. Keep bouncing back and forth. I use the Blood Fang Dash attack just to get that quick kill. And it does a nice decent amount of damage on the enemies. So I suggest that you guys rinse and repeat this. And you will end up with a lot, a lot of ruins to level yourself up if you are in the mid game. If this video has helped you, please don't forget to smash the like button. Subscribe and also hit that notification bell. Also check out my channel for anything else Elden Ring. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.